The Pikeville YMCA held an event on Friday afternoon dedicating the opening of their new splash pad amenity to the memory of Bruce Elliott, a man who is now remembered for helping his community in any way he could. We're really excited to be able to open our splash pad today and dedicate it to T. Bruce Elliott. Uh, the Elliott companies have been instrumental in all of the various expansions of the YMCA and even so today through their donation of the splash pad. Uh, and we felt it appropriate that, uh, you know, along with the Elliott companies that we honor uh, T. Bruce Elliott and his family and his efforts uh, by naming the splash pad after him. Justice Fouts mentioned that the construction of the splash pad was made possible through partnerships with several different organizations and individuals in our area. Through partnerships with Fahi and Community Ventures, uh, they provided funding for their project uh, through a community facility relending loan. Um, and then the City of Pikeville also contributed to the project, um, Community Trust, Pikeville Rotary Club. Uh, those are some of, the, uh, of our larger donors. A central theme of the dedication on Friday focused on the YMCA's involvement with our local community as well as their plans to continue growing to help meet the needs of our residents. Uh, I think it's great to see what we offer the community and just really want the community to know that we're here for them. Uh, we spoke not long ago uh, about you know being for all and being for our community um, and you know let people know that we're here and it's not just we're often thought of as a swim and gym but we're so much more you know we're licensed child care, we're youth sports, uh, community engagement, community outreach, uh, food outreach, we, you know we do summer food service and uh, communities, uh, meals into the communities uh, for people who may need them. Um, and you know, now we have indoor swim lessons, we'll have aqua aerobics, uh, you know, it's recreation for all ages. Dick Jarvis, president of the Elliott Company, echoed these same sentiments of community outreach and involvement, sentiments he says were instilled in him by none other than Bruce Elliott himself. Bruce Elliott was a unique individual. He taught myself and Harold that uh, Sometimes it's not how much money you make as a company, but it's what you do to help your community grow. And uh, he instilled that in us, and I feel like that, that we've carried on that legacy, uh, and we're happy and proud of what we've been able to help the YMCA accomplish here over the years. If you haven't been here, you need to come and see it. You need to use it, and I would encourage everyone to support the Y get involved. Uh, if you can donate financially that'd be great but there's always a way to donate your time. Uh, it's a community project, a community facility and I'd encourage everyone to get involved. For more information on the YMCA's new aquatic center as well as all of the other services they have to offer, Justice Fouts encourages residents to visit them online, especially their Facebook page. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joshua Sloan.